Hello, beautiful entrepreneurs. If you are a woman entrepreneur that feels like you're spinning your wheels, you're lying awake at night thinking, what can I do next to get my next client? If that's you, pay close attention because this is going to be really great for you. So if you're kind of just frustrated, if you're feeling stuck, if you're kind of guessing, hoping, praying for that next client to come, you need a strategy and you might need also a mindset shift. So what happens is in our society, we are trained to be workers. And then all of a sudden you have this great idea or you have a product or a service that you, or maybe you went to some specialized training as a coach or a therapist or what have you. Um, you weren't taught how to market properly. You weren't taught how to get clients to buy from you. Maybe you do have people contacting you, but they're just not paying you what you're worth. And there's a way to do this, okay? And the first thing you need to do is wrap your head around being an entrepreneur, wrap your head around being a, a business owner, because it's a completely different mindset than what we have been taught in school. Our whole curriculum, our whole society, everything our parents learned, our friends, our family, it was all learned around being a worker, right? So that's a one way of thinking. That's one way of doing things. But when you become a business owner, when you become an entrepreneur, now you need to shift that mindset to a completely different way of thinking. And nobody's teaching this, okay? Even in school, I've got, I've got clients with MBAs and business degrees that tell me that they don't teach not just the mindset piece, but the whole strategy uh, that I teach my clients on how to get clients pretty simply, actually. Uh, but you don't know what you don't know, right? It's up here in the blinders. You can see other people doing things that are working right? You kind of look around and maybe you, you know, figure out how to price yourself based on what they're doing. Maybe you, th you think to yourself, uh, if I undercut uh, my competitors just a little bit more, then people will definitely uh, buy from me. But what have you noticed? It's not working, right? So there is a way to, to do this. And what happens is <clears throat> when we're in this certain mentality, our business is like a mirror. So it, it reflects back to us exactly what we're feeling, what we're thinking. You might be thinking that you're not portraying that or you're not letting people know. You're, you're kind of pretending that you're successful maybe so people will never know. But that doesn't work either. What happens is when we're feeling a certain way, if we're feeling scarcity or we're feeling scared or, or we're feeling desperate, as much as you think that's not coming across, it's actually an energy that's vibrating out and people can tell right away. So there's a way to get over that too. And it's a deep dive, you know, into certain things, but there's a way to do that. There's different exercises that can shift you out of that where you come across authentically. And if you want to come across, uh, if you want to be authentic, uh, you got to have the confidence. But where does the confidence come from? The confidence comes from clarity, right? So if you're confused about how to get clients yourself, if you're confused about if I, you know, what do I do next to get these clients to pay me what I'm worth and it's going on month after month after month, soon enough, when I hear it all the time from my clients and from people calling me, that eats away at your confidence. But as soon as you know what to do, just to picture that for a minute, a minute, if you know what to do, if you know that I'm going to spend 15 minutes writing these specific words in a specific way to get it to really resonate with my ideal client and have, that has them call you over and over and over again, and you've got a place for them to go and you have a whole strategy to follow that just leads them from one thing into the next into paying you what you're worth. You know, my clients get paid three to $10,000 typically for what they have to offer. Not before they come to me, though. Usually what they're doing is an hours for dollars type model where they'll be working for 100 bucks an hour or trying to sell a $20 product to lead them into a bigger thing or, or whatever. There's a lot of old ways of doing things. And what I'm hearing from my clients, what they used to do before they come, came to me was they would be posting everywhere with no clear strategy, posting on Facebook, posting on Instagram, doing podcasts, writing blogs, like doing all these things that really are a waste of time if you don't know how to do it correctly, if there's no real clear strategy behind it. Whereas if you know what to do and you know what to say and you know how to say it so that it piques someone's curiosity so much that they want to know more um, to contact you or to come in your store or whatever it is, 
there's a way to do that. And it's way more time effective, way more cost effective because you're not just throwing money at the wall and throwing things at the wall to see what sticks. You know, if I spend 15 minutes writing this post, it's going to lead to somebody calling me uh, within you know, 24 to 48 hours typically. So this is what I talk about in my free workshop, actually, if you're interested in learning a bit more about how my clients five times their income, how they get paid what they're worth, how they stand out as a go-to expert when nobody's ever heard of them, all these things. I'm going to put the link below and you can get some more details on that as the five steps that my clients focus on in order to have time and money freedom to do what they really love to do without spending a lot of time and energy on ineffective marketing. It's amazing. So check it out. It's probably going to be the best 45 minutes you'll ever spend on your business and investing in yourself. Totally free. Okay. So the other thing I talk about in there is bundling your value. So um, you're probably great at what you do. And a lot of my clients are. They're, they're, they get great results for their clients, for the ones that are have an established business, but they've just been struggling to get the clients. They'll get them here, they'll get them there, but not a consistent, they, won't, they don't have a consistent pipeline, basically, which means they didn't have five people calling them today and know that they've got five more tomorrow and the next day calling them for what they want. So I teach them how to set that up. Uh, for themselves as well. But what I also teach is to take everything they've got, if they do have a business already, take everything they've got or just take that knowledge and bundle it into something that's extremely valuable for people. Usually they typically charge between $3,000 and $10,000. And when you do that, what's great about that is they go from, you know, making $100 an hour and we only have so much time in our day which then puts a cap on that amount. So let's say they want to make $5,000 a month. Well, you do the math on that. They do $100 an hour. How many clients do they need or how many hours do they need to hit the $5,000? But if they've got one offer, that's $5,000. They only need one client, right, to hit that same amount. So if you only need one client and then you automate as much as possible around what you're doing, this is what we do all day, every day. We take what we can automate, that allows the time and money leverage. So if we automate, you know, 80% of what that can be automated in their business, and and usually they come to me not knowing how to do that, they're left with 20% of that they have to do in person maybe. And that basically for, you know, if one, they've got one client and they're only doing 20% of the work that they were doing before, how does that work, right? So now they've got, they're hitting their financial goals. If it's 5,000, if it's 10,000, they only need two clients, 15,000, three clients, right? And so on and so on. But then adding very minimal time to their schedule. And also what happens after they work with me is that they get amazing results, even better results than they did before for their clients. So if you're not really sure about how to go about doing that, I highly recommend taking 45 minutes, just watching that free workshop. There's a ton of value in there seeing how it can apply to what you're doing, because I'm sure it can. It's always the same blueprint. I've been doing this since 1996. I've helped business owners of all kinds, but that's when I noticed it. I noticed that there were certain things that successful, the successful business owners were doing in order to have time and money freedom to do what they want to do and how to scale that so they could go and take vacations with their family and have time for self-care and they were all very relaxed and then I saw the opposite I saw business owners that just didn't follow the the proven formula and didn't do certain things that they should have been doing and completely crashed burned they got overwhelmed they got stressed and within three to five years they lost their entire investment which really sucked You know, so that's why I created the Money Map Blueprint. I took all of the things that the successful business owners were doing. I put it together in a step-by-step recipe to follow. I created it so it can work with any type of business. Okay, it's very adaptable. And the great thing is, is that you put it towards one business. And let's say you have multiple business ideas, because a lot of my clients do as entrepreneurs. We're kind of like shiny object syndrome. But you get the one working and then you just take that same blueprint and can keep applying it and applying it and applying it or shift it and adapt it to accommodate to what just happened here with the pandemic. So a lot of people were crashing and burning. Tons of businesses are going out of business right now. Very scary. But my clients are still thriving. They're still growing. They're still hiring people. They're doing well because they've just took the blueprint, 
shifted gears a little bit, adapted to the situation, and they're fine. They didn't have to close their doors. So this is what I'm talking about. It's a formula. When you're creating a business, especially a business where you want time and money freedom, because a lot of people, they go out there and then they create a job for themselves and they get overwhelmed. They get stressed. They, you know, they're working their butt off. They're kind of taking on anyone and everyone and not really picking and choosing who they want to work with. Again, they're usually doing that hours per dollars model, which again, leads to burnout in a cap because you can only make so much because there's only so many hours in the day, right? But once you follow this recipe, I, I often say it's like baking a cake. If you bake a cake and you miss a step or you do it out of order, you put the icing on the cake, you put it in the oven, it's not going to turn out. But if you follow the recipe, you put the cake in the oven, you let it cool, then you put the icing on, it's delicious. You get your a great result. And it's the same thing with setting up a business. When you want time and money leverage, instead of creating a job for yourself, I mean, did we really get into this for creating a job for ourselves? Not really. We want that time. We want that money. I mean, money gives options, right? It gives us options to do what we really love to do. But it's one thing to make a ton of money and then not have the time to enjoy it. So we need both, right? So I designed this program for both. And this is what my clients and I do. We focus on these five things instead of the million things that all the gurus are, are telling you to do. Just focus on the five things. It's quite simple. Put some work to get going in the beginning, but then once it's set up, awesome. Then you've got this flow, this flow of clients coming in, calling, instead of cold calling and chasing and trying to find all these people, they find you. How nice is that? So if you are not really sure about how to do that, if you feel like you're spinning your wheels, if you feel like you're buying all these cheap or free things, little courses here, little courses there, and they're just bits and pieces to what you need, I strongly urge you to watch the free workshop because it's a complete system from A to Z on how to get you very crystal clear. That's a big, big, big thing. And again, the confidence comes with clarity on what to do. Just imagine how that would feel if you knew what to do. If you woke up in the morning, you're like, right, I know exactly what to do today in order to get my business with a strong foundation, in order to get the clients coming in consistently. What if you had that direction? How amazing would that feel? What would you do with that time and money freedom if you were hitting your goals and you we're working the ideal amount of time that you wanted to work and making a huge impact on people, right? Because I'm sure a lot of you are doing this because you want to impact people. You want to help people. You want to serve people. That's what we're here to do. That's what makes life fulfilling. So if you're not really sure on how to communicate your value properly, if you're not really sure on how to set yourself up and position yourself as a go-to expert against the competition because I know that that is also something that a lot of my clients uh, struggle with before they become clients. They don't really know how to position themselves as a go-to expert against their competition. They just try and compete. They just say, oh, my, my industry is saturated and I know it works because other people are doing it. I just don't know why isn't it working for me? You know, they're lying awake at night, trying to just racking their brains, losing sleep at night. They're stressed out, fighting with their spouse. All they're hearing is, go get a real job. Forget this. And it's, it's, it's not the dream that they really thought it was going to be. It, it quickly becomes a nightmare when you can't get the clients that you need to get. And I totally get it because I've been there and I see it all the time, every day. Like I said, even my clients with business degrees and MBAs don't get taught this stuff, which completely boggles my mind. They spend hundreds of thousands of dollars on, on uh, MBA or, or business program and, and come out with it not knowing how to get clients. What the heck? So anyway, check out the link below and I will see you in the workshop. Have a great day.